What's up guys, I'm LQ, this is the LQ Review. Thank you so much for joining me here at my YouTube channel. This is where I talk about all the geeky, nerdy stuff that I love to talk about. Movies, video games, comic books, TV shows, and right now I'm going to give you guys my trailer reaction to the video game coming out, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. And this sounds like, from the descriptions that I've read online, that this is going to be an old school type of Ninja Turtle game, which is right up my alley. Because I am a big fan of those old Ninja Turtle games. You got the classic NES game. Which isn't as good as some of those side-scroller beat-em-ups. But it still has its place in Ninja Turtle lore. And then you get into probably the greatest Ninja Turtle game ever. Well, maybe not. We'll get to that in a second. Here's Turtles 2, the arcade game. Such a fantastic fantastic game. I still like to play this game. And then you've got Ninja Turtles 3 The Manhattan Project. Um, it was basically a direct continuation of the arcade game. Uh, not as good as the arcade game but still 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 quite good. Switching over to the Super NES Tournament Fighters. Remember Tournament Fighters how much fun that was? Tournament Fighters was a blast. And then, this might be the best Ninja Turtle game ever. It could very well be. Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time. This could be the one, right? This could be the winner, right? And then, of course, for the Wii, I've got Smash Up. So I do like those old school Ninja Turtle games. I have a lot of fun playing them. So this game is going to be right up my alley. Before we start, though, why don't you comment down below, what is your favorite old school Ninja Turtle game? Is it the arcade game? Is it Turtles in Time? Are you somebody that maybe uh, maybe you thought Manhattan Project was superior to the arcade game? Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Alright, let's get to this reaction. All right, so so I apologize, guys. I definitely had some sound issue on that, um, but it looks great. <laughs> it looks great. Um, it definitely has a lot of. Um, I mean, it was definitely inspired by by these games, right? The Turtles in Time, the Turtles to the arcade game, um, the Manhattan Project. Definitely inspired by that set of games. It almost feels like a sequel to these, right? Like there's even a sequence in, in the trailer where I saw. Um, one of the turtles throwing a foot soldier at the screen just like they would do in this game so it definitely feels very um um very authentic and very very much like a continuation of those games which is great um yeah i i think this looks wonderful i i, I cannot wait to buy this game my only fear my only fear is that this is going to feel like a mobile game like i recently bought cobra kai i uh, bought it for the switch and um, that game, that felt like a mobile game. That felt like something for, that I could download for free on my phone. And that's my only concern here. 
Now, I don't think they're going to go that route here. I really think that it looks to me like they put a lot of care. They put a lot of love. It looks like the, the people that made this game were definitely fans of the property. And that makes that gives me hope that this is going to be more than just that side scroller beat em up. That this is there's going to be a lot of Easter eggs. There's going to be a lot of uh, uh, there's going to be a good story and there's going to be some great content in this game. So I'm really excited about it. I will be buying this when this comes out. So are you as excited about this game as me? Let me know in the comments down below it what you think if you'll be playing it and. Um, while you're down there uh, discussing it with me, let's uh, make sure we subscribe to my channel. I put out a lot of content, and I want to make sure that you're up to date with everything that I'm doing. And as always, thank you so much for joining me right here at the LQ Review. I apologize for that sound problem again. Thank you for joining me, and until next time, we'll see you later.